you may be looking for the 2005 TV episode. The Daleks were a warrior race. TV, the witch's familiar, hellbent, made up of genetically engineered mutants. TV, the Daleks, genesis of the Daleks, belonging to fundamental DNA type 467 to 989. TV, Daleks in Manhattan, by most accounts they were originally from the planet Scaro. TV, the Daleks, the mutants were encased inside an armored travel machine built from polycarbide. TV, Remembrance of the Daleks, and the Metal Dalekinium. TV, The Dalek Invasion of Earth, Comic, The Humanoids, On many occasions, the Daleks openly acknowledged a single Time Lord, the Doctor, as the greatest enemy. TV, The Chase, The Doctor described them likewise, Comic, Defender of the Daleks, TV, Victory of the Daleks, and, in the Tenth Incarnation, stated that a Dalek was, not just metal, it alive, that, inside that shell, they're a creature born to hate, whose only thought to destroy everything and everyone that a Dalek, too. TV. Daleks in Manhattan. The Tenth Doctor also noted that from birth, the Daleks were encased in a cold metal shell unable to feel anything, claiming that was why they, scream. TV. Doomsday. The War Doctor also said that Daleks were, not robots, but, savage, incredibly intelligent, living, breathing creatures housed inside a war tank. Pros. The Stranger. The Daleks fought the Time Lords in the last Great Time War, ending in the near-total destruction of the Dalek race, TV, Dalek, until they rebuilt their empire, TV, Asylum of the Daleks, by using a progenitor. TV, Victory of the Daleks, intensely xenophobic and bent on universal domination, the Daleks were hated and feared throughout time and space. TV, Genesis of the Daleks. The goal was to eradicate all non-Dalek life, TV victory of the Daleks, as programmed by their creator. TV. Genesis of the Daleks.